What's up, good people? What's up, good people? It's your boy, Dr. Leroy McKenzie Jr., the Impact Builder. I know I'm late today, y'all. I know I'm late, but I had an appointment this morning uh, that I absolutely could not miss. So I'm coming back to you right now. Right now, y'all know what we've been doing. This is Work For It Wednesday. Y'all know what we do on Wednesday. We put in that work. We put in that work because we've got, and it's not going to get done unless we do it. So we've got to put that work in. And this week, y'all know what we're doing, what we're focusing on uh, today. Today, today, today is the first day of Black History Month. Today is the first day of Black History Month. And what we've been doing these first, uh, actually the two days prior to uh, today, Black History Month, y'all know it, it's Black History Month 365. For me, but we've been focusing on uh, your five steps to building your business ecosystem. We've been focusing on the, uh, your ecosystem, but we've also been focusing on and talking about the template that we have uh, the the uh, the black print, uh, which is Black Wall Street. Black Wall Street, uh, for those that don't know, was a area in Tulsa, Oklahoma, that was flourishing back in the early 1900s. Until 1921, when the city was actually um, burned down uh, and and rioted upon um, for no other reason than being financially flourishing, and that's why it, where it got its name, Black Wall Street. It was actually just as strong and doing as well as Wall Street was, and it was this small area in Tulsa, Oklahoma, that was flourishing, doing well. But what we're talking about is how they built that ecosystem, the business ecosystem that is Black Wall Street. And here are the things that we've been focusing on this week. We've been focusing on vision, creativity, and today we're going to talk about patience. What patience gets you, what patience can get you. So let's talk about it. And and understand they had before I turn it around on me, y'all. They had if y'all can see that. Hopefully you can see that. They had a total of six hundred businesses. They had twenty one, uh, twenty one churches, twenty one restaurants. Uh, was it um, uh, grocery stores? Thirty grocery stores. Sit uh, two, um, two movie theaters. Six. Uh, private airplanes, y'all, six private airplanes, they had a hospital, they had a library, they had a post office, they had a schooling system, uh, and then they also had a bus system. That was the ecosystem of Black Wall Street. That was the ecosystem of Black Wall Street, y'all. I hope y'all, hope y'all grab that, you know, and, and, and see what they were able to do with, uh, what they were able to build, uh, back then. So understand that. See what they were able to build. 600 businesses total. And and how they used that to be able to have this business ecosystem right in this town. And 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 they did so well <laughs> that that the uh the folks that were living across the railroad tracks there were jealous of how well that they were living and flourishing and doing. And all they wanted was an excuse to be able to go in and destroy what we now know as Black Wall Street. But here's what we wanted to talk about today. What I wanted to talk about today is patience. Patience. Any entrepreneur that that's listening to me, hear me, hear me really, 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 really well. It, it will take patience in order for you to be able to build your business. Every and I've and I say this all the time. Every Fortune 500 company started off as a small business. There's not one that started off as a Fortune 500 company. If it did, y'all let me know because I, from what I've seen, there's not been one that started off as a as a uh, that didn't start off as a small business. So understand that it takes time to build your business. It takes time to build your career. For those that may not be entrepreneurs, for those that may be um, that may be uh, in a in a industry, and you're building your career, it takes time to build your career. So you've got to be patient and have a strategy. And we'll talk about that tomorrow. We're going to talk about planning, but it takes a strategy where you understand, hey, this is there's there's different phases to what it is that you're building. 
the Rockefellers didn't build their name, their their uh, their empire overnight. It took a it it took a mindset. It took it took vision. It, it took creativity, and it took patience because it took time to be able to build what it was that Mr. Rockefeller back 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 in the day was building. Same thing here with Black Wall Street. It, like I said, the, the, the town was burned down in 1921. So you have to understand and believe that the town of Tulsa, where Black Wall Street was started, didn't it just didn't happen overnight. It took years to build what they built. It took years to build it. It only took two days to, to burn it down. But it took years to put in place what they put in place, to put that business ecosystem in place. They had buses, they had churches, they had a library, they had a library, they had planes, they had what wasn't on that list, they had a hotel. Trust and understand what it takes in order to be able to build your business ecosystem. It's going to take patience. You you may feel some days where, you know, it's not working. You may be frustrated, tired. But your patience has to kick in. You're going to have those days that it may not seem like you're building what you're building. But but when you when you take the time and the effort to put into the building, you'll reap. If you, you know, if you faint not as the Bible says, I'm not trying to get churchy on y'all. But it, the Bible says, don't get weary in well doing. But if you, if you faint not, if you faint not, you, it, you, it, you will be successful. But at the at, it says at faint not it runs that you will reap a, the harvest. Patience is what will get you the harvest of your business ecosystem. So it, and it may not seem like you're building the partnerships. It may not seem like you're building the relationships that you want to build with your business ecosystem. But if you have a plan, you got that vision, and you understand the vision, and you stick to it, stick to those principles that I've been talking about from the, since the beginning of the year. If you stick to those principles, be patient with them. Be patient with building the relationships, and those relationships would flourish into resources. I promise you, they will. But you, but you've got to be patient with it. They were they were very patient. They were very patient in what they were building and how they built it. That business ecosystem that Black Wall Street had was a a machine. The the, the dollars cycling, recycling within itself. That's what it's all about. So on this first day of a Black History Month, and, and we're gonna do something different. This year, because I know you, you're going to hear the, the Dr. King, I have a dream speech about 50 times this month. You'll hear the usual things that you hear, but not not here. Because I'm going to be talking about things like this, building the the business ecosystem. Black Wall Street from an, a, a, a lens that you haven't heard it talked about before. How do you go about building your business ecosystem? Putting that strategy together. So that you can nourish the relationships that you have or that you that you're trying to build. You got to connect, build and grow those relationships because those relationships are resources. And that's what Black Wall Street was about. They were about the relationships and they were about the resources that they had. That's what I want you to carry today. On this work for it, you got to work for it Wednesday. You got to work for it. You got to work for it, but you got to be patient in the working. You can't lose 50 pounds overnight. Can't lose 100 pounds overnight. Can't eat an elephant overnight. You got to eat it one piece at a time. Be patient with it. That's what I want you to do today. I want you to be patient with it. 
if, if you get frustrated, and, and we all do, I get frustrated just like everybody else. But understand what you're building. Understand the connections that you're making. Understanding the rooms that you're getting into. Somebody, you know, doesn't, doesn't do the deal with you or the deal doesn't close. Hey, it's on to the next one. And the next one, and the next one, and the next one. But it takes patience. It takes patience. That's what I, that's the word I want you to focus on today, patience. Have patience with building your business ecosystem today. Have patience. Work for it. I want you to work for it. But I want you to also be patient. Be patient in the building, y'all. That that's what Black Wall Street did. Like I said, nineteen twenty one was when the when the town was was burned down. But prior to nineteen twenty one, y'all, it took years to build that. It a patience to to nurture the relationships that they had with each other, that that, that town had with each other. So understand that we in this twenty first century can do the same thing. But we got to be patient. I promise you, in the patience, you'll, you'll, reap the, you'll reap the benefits. You'll reap the harvest. You'll reap the harvest of your patience. Put that plan together. Take that vision. Write it down. Make it plain. So that you understand who are the people that you need to talk to. Who are the, the people that, that, that you need to connect with to build that business business ecosystem who's already in your business ecosystem and how can you how can you grow that that's what I want you to look at today how do you grow it we're in 2023 we're we're in February of 2023 so you got a, a year to build on that relationship you got a year to to be patient and understand phase one phase two phase three phase four phase five quarter one Quarter two, quarter three, quarter four. We're in the first quarter. The first quarter is about the foundation. It's all about the foundation. It's all about patience you need in the first in that in this first quarter. Because you're building something. Map it out. Map it out. Understand. Patience, y'all. That's what we're talking about on this work for Wednesday. Black Wall Street, Black History Month. We're, we're going to be all month, 28, we're going hard for 28 days and beyond. Y'all know it's not going to be just 28 days. It's going to be beyond the 28 days. And I like that, beyond the 28 days. So that's what we're doing. Y'all know my mission, my purpose is to make you better by the end of the year than you were at the beginning of the year. We do that by having a, a, a business ecosystem in place to take your business to that next level. When that first, when the the second month of the first quarter, what you doing? Practice your patience. It's your boy, Dr. Leary McKenzie Jr., the Impact Builder. We'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Have a great, great, great day. We'll talk to y'all soon.